today we'll be doing our first impressions on Nick Sales Award books. So today let's start off with Black Panther and Nation Under Our Feet. So tell us a bit about it. Well, looking at Black Panther book, it looks quite modern. It looks like a, like an, another Marvel book. You would, like notice that it's Marvel, and it's expected for like the first Black Panther book because it's from the Civil War. Hello, I'm Dean. I've been charged with reviewing the manga. This one called Shuriken and Pleats, Volume One. Basically, it's a book about a girl, highly trained ninja, lethal, dangerous and someone that she loved has been murdered a lot of mystery it's like a lot of other mangas you know okay so i've got the on the wings of the world book and basically it's a book on birds and the guy's basically um he was a real person in the 19th century and i like the front cover isn't that interesting um but the artwork looks good and the, the book feels good as well superman lows and clock this book is very important to like the future of DC Comics because it's the road to rebirth and the first front cover doesn't look that in enticing because it's got too much on it and it's not the traditional Superman costume. I've got the Captain America white book. The artwork looks very old fashioned and that's probably linked to the fact that this is set in World War II. So, I mean, the back of the comic looks like a document which makes it look really cool. So I, I quite like the look of this. I've got the Yona of the Dawn. I'm not interested in manga and all that stuff and anime. Uh, so, my first impression, it doesn't look that interesting. It's like the same with the sh Shuriken. It looks like another girl that likes to kill, yeah? Okay. Clear blue to my rose. And I'm just going to say straight off the bat, I see a lot of blue. First impressions. It's a comic. Okay. Cool. Okay, thank you. And finally, the last book we have is we are Robin. Uh, I, my first impression is that I don't particularly like it because, you know, if you are Robin, there's only one Robin in the Batman universe unless that more Robin dies. So this is a group of people being Robin. I don't particularly like the idea. And it's not a traditional DC comic. I think it looks boring. It's probably okay, but yeah, I don't like it. Thank you for listening.